Welcome back to another tutorial video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use XXMI. I've been getting a lot of questions regarding this. There are a few things I want to clarify first. Number one, this isn't a virus. This is flagged as a virus, but it's not a real virus. Apparently the developers of this, they had to pay like $800 or something. They had to pay a lot of money in order to get like a safety check on Game Banana, but since you know they're broke, they basically had to put it out as it is and for whatever reason your pc will just or the game banana website will recognize it as a virus it's not a virus i have it installed on my pc everything is working just fine if it was a virus i'd just take down this video and just maybe put like a community post and a video talking about this being a virus and number two i don't think this is a necessary program i don't know why they made this. I really don't. The only reason I'm using this is because there was a Nicole mod I wanted to play around with and it required using this XXMI. So here I am making a tutorial video on how to use XXMI. By the way, if you happen to like this video, just leave a like and subscribe and all that good stuff would be greatly appreciated. So I will have a link to this somewhere, maybe in the pinned comment, most likely. You basically just download this, try to like, I know your PC will like recognize it as a virus, but believe me, it's not a virus. I have it installed. Just download it like normal. And once you boot it up, you unzip the thing and then you will have a installation page. Because I have the thing installed already, I, I can't really show you that bit, but I will show you a video of somebody else doing it and talk over it. So. Once you unzip the XXMI, you will be greeted with um, you'll be greeted with this. You basically hit custom installation and you just install it to wherever you want to install it. And just make sure that the create desktop to shortcut is checked. And then you'll just hit install. By the way, shout outs to um, Wujo, by the way, for just showing us this, right? You subscribe to them. They're pretty cool very handsome fellow. Once you have it installed onto your desktop, you should see it on your desktop somewhere. You click on that bitch, hit yes. And then here you go. This is basically what XXMI looks like. You have all of the moddable gacha games on the top left. You can basically select which one to, you know, mod. This is basically just your typical 3D Migoto, but in a more open sense, I guess, right? You have everything you want right here. Every gacha game that's moddable, except for uh, except for Honkai Impact. Honkai Impact is not on here, but Honkai Impact hardly gets any mod. So this still basically works just like any other 3D Migoto. If you click here on the three dots, you basically have the open mods folder. Uh, check for updates, repairs, EZMI, you have all this uh, fancy stuff. You basically open the mods folder and this is basically where your mods will be at. This is where you put your mods in. So you can just close that and you can basically just hit start and it'll start the game for you. With it modded, of course. All right, so here we go. Everything's all modded. Everything works just as any other 3D Migoto program and that's basically about it we fighting take me need something my services are expensive. this is the nicole mod i wanted to play with it only works with xxmi shout out to xc for creating this but yeah that's basically about it that's that's all i only really wanted to use xxmi because it was the only way i could play with this nicole mod so there you go if you have any questions let me know in the comments below i'll also have a link to the anime modding gaming group discord in the pinned comment as well so if i can't answer a question you could probably ask them and they'll be more than happy to help you out and that's basically about it see you guys later bye bye now come again soon <laughs>